getting the correct royal icing consistency for flooding your cookies can be a little bit tricky in the beginning, but it is well worth it to make sure that you have the right texture. I always like to make sure that it can grab onto my spatula and become completely smooth with a little shake. To make sure that the royal icing stays nice and puffy and I don't get any indentations, I do like to use my piping bag and I make an outline first and then I fill it in later on. And since we're using the same consistency for both the piping and the flooding, also known as pipe and flood consistency, I'm not going to get any lines on the outside. It's just going to fill in this cookie. When you get the consistency right, you don't need to shake it. You don't need to pop any air bubbles. It's just nice and smooth. Head on over to my channel if you want to see full tutorials.